ball because he misjudged it. He was injured. So McCurdy back in and right field defensively. That is lined over to Ballesteri, who makes the catch and an easy double play. He'll do it himself. A fantastic leaping grab. Bob Ballesteri takes an RBI hit away from DePreta Johnson. Pitch for pitch. Hancock lines this one into left center field. That's a base hit. He's going to make the turn. He's headed for second base. It's kicked by Halloran, but it will be a leadoff stand-up double by the bear catcher, William Hancock. Her infielders bearing down on him. Gets the bunt down. Great play by Sanchez. They're going to throw to third, and he is safe. They made a mistake doing that, and the Bears have runners at the corners. Nobody else. Presley hits this one hard into center field. Ottenover makes the grab. Hancock tags. He's headed home. They throw it to second base. The sack fly gives the Bears a 1-0 lead. The pitch. It's hit right on the ground to Ballesteri. He'll send it to Sanchez to relay to first. In time with the stretch, and the Bears get the inning-ending double play. They're second in a row. High chopper, and it'll be fielded by the pitcher. Marshall slings it to first, and he throws it away as Aguilar was safe already. He's going to take second base on the throwing error. A hit and a throwing error by Marshall, and the Bears have a leadoff runner on second base for the second straight inning. 2-1 pitch. Ballesteri drives it into shallow right field. Brent slices over. He will be near the line. He makes the catch running in. Here comes Aguilar. The throw is in time, but he slides in safe. 2-0 Central Arkansas. A great throw by Brents and an even better slide by Rigo, and it's 2 nothing. Lead here in the seventh inning. That is lined into right field. That's going to fall for a hit. Strong's going to be waved home, and he will score without a throw. McCarty comes through to give the Bears a 3 nothing lead. Here it is, and it's a chopper right back in front of the mound. Picked up by Hagelin, thrown to first in time. The Bears shut out HBU 3 nothing. High fives, handshakes, and a championship game appearance coming up for the Bears at 6 o'clock. They take out HBU, HBU in the rematch here today, 3-0. A complete game shutout for Brandon Hagerla. His third complete game as a UCA Bear, and they line up in the middle of Diamond. And one more time, the Bears will lace it up at 6 o'clock, taking on the same Houston State Bearcats. The third championship game appearance for the Bears in the last five seasons.